I mean, a spell damage or Ross would be amazing. <gasps> yes, okay. I have a plan. All I've got to do is play a buttload of spells, right? That's all I got to do. I need to play you, and then I need to play this bounce again. That becomes zero. We go Cloak, and we go Jandis. And if we get more spell damage, I mean, that's kind of cracked, actually. And then we rush. That should wipe, right? No, I was off in the math. That was okay. Honestly, could have been worse. Okay, I do think I like this version of the deck better. Since I've switched to a slightly more aggressive, in terms of draw, build, it's been going really well. Do I want two dirty tricks? I could keep one and just play it to draw some cards if he ever ends up playing a spell, because he probably will at some point. Oh, that's really bad. That's really quite awful, isn't it? The reason why that's bad is because of sketchy information. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, you need to just let me get one sketchy information off, right? It's got to be at least one. Brain Freeze doesn't really do anything. He'll probably play a spell and I'll draw cards. I mean, I'm willing to bet that it's Devolving Missiles and I'm going to get wrecked. We play Ticketmaster. If he gets Devolving Missile, then we're able to play like Lillian, which is a little bit more aggressive. Sketchy information. Nah, we'll play that. We'll play sketchy information next turn. I want to get a minion out on the board. This might be devolving missiles. My bet is it is always devolving missiles. It's always devolving missiles. Are there even any other one drop spells? God, dude. Pissing me off out here. There have got to be other one drop spells, truly. Let's play a uh, stealth to Lillian. We're gonna play this next turn. I'd, I'd, I'd like him to commit a little bit more. Maybe I can trade in a little bit or something. Okay. The second Devolving Missiles was admittably not expected. Heart of Cthulhu. Next turn, sketchy information. This will be free. And then eventually we'll be able to bounce stuff with, um, scabs. Which I don't know if that's necessarily going to be good. Like, ah, oh, this is so frustrating. He devolved all of my best dudes. It's so sad. Jandis? Dude, they keep just giving me better options. But I need to kill off something. If I do that, that'll be free. So I can kill that and kill this. Or at least freeze it for now. So we kill this. He gets a card. I don't care. We play Ticketmaster. Don't have another devolving, please. And then we can go like Jandis, Brain Freeze, or Scabs on, a, on a, another turn. Wait, what? What did he just... Oh, draw two cards. He only draws one, though, so that's cool. Oh. I don't want to bounce the bird back to his hand. That's bad. I think we play Jandis this turn. Absolute useless card. We can play Scabs next turn, but I don't want to bounce that back to his hand. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. It's nine damage. I mean, I'm dead to almost anything, right, at this point. Like, the game's basically over. Maybe I can trade. Oh, he's not hitting my face. Oh, that's so nice. I get to scabs and not take much damage. That's actually really, really good. Wind chill, I do not care. I do not care about that. No. And he has another one. That's so bad. Oh. Malevolent strike. I mean, it's good. Don't get me wrong, but. Keep your enemies close. And then we're going to hero power and play sketchy information and get nothing. I mean, it's useless. It's more to just get it out of my hand. That's actually kind of important because that is a potential win condition card gone because he needs the lightning bloom to get the combo off. I'll kill that. That's annoying, but I'll kill at least a couple of things. 
Um, let's see what we draw for this first. We'll get two spells, which is nice. And then I think I would like to just play... Oh! I do have a three-cost spell in there. That's so sick. And then I could Shadow Step him and do it again and just draw a bunch of cards. Oh, I should have played you. I have another Shadow Step. I can do that and then the SI Extortion will kill one. Yeah, that works for me. Malevolent. SI Extortion should now do four. And then we still have Maw. And do I want to Shadow Step him? I'll get... A secret passage, and like another swindle, and then more tickets. Yeah, I think it's worth. He's got another stupid bird though, which is really frustrating. And I mean, maybe if they last long enough, I can get a good Eye of Cthune off. Oh. Interesting, okay, fair enough. My boss was a stupid weapon rogue. That that's rough, buddy. Actually, it is. I I feel kind of bad. It's so frustrating playing against that sometimes. Let's go with I cannot play all 3 of these. No, I can. I can play all 3 of them. We can kill off 1 2 3. Wait, was that not 11? Oh, that's 13. I'm so dumb. We'll do that. I should have done that earlier. We get tickets. That's not bad. I mean, if we get Eye of Cthune, that'd be pretty sick. We don't. I think I'd rather do this and Barrett. Or no, we'll just go with the Taunt. I don't know why I thought 5 plus 5 plus 3 was 11. That was just bad math. Bolner, Yashiraj, I mean... Most likely dead, right? Very soon to be dead. Because I can't get to Cthune in time. I mean, maybe I can. There's a possibility that I can. I mean, he still has a couple of cards he needs to play, right? He still needs Lightning Bloom and Bolner. Okay. And I want to play one thief and see what I get. Swindle. We already do the secret passage. Tickets fine. Into Eye of Cthulhu. That could be very, very good. Evocation. Ignite. Both of these are solid. I think it's got to be ignite though. Then we do this ignite, and we can trade this away. I just need to not die this turn. Did I just troll? I think I might have trolled slightly. Trade this away first. I should have done that to begin with. Useless. Um, okay, so we go swin- no, we go ignite on this. And then trade face, pass. We try to find Cthune next turn. It's possible. It's not probable. If he has Yashiraj and Bolner, I lose. He is overloaded one though. He actually can't play them both this turn. We just need some of these minions to connect. Oh my God, what? Jeez Louise, that actually is fine though. I mean, he is so overloaded next turn, he cannot kill me. So that's actually helpful for me, to be quite honest. Evocation with Passage. Are you serious? Are you serious? Did you really just get that? Okay, so never mind, I lost. I mean, unless I get Cthune, how much life does he have? I need him to be at 26 or less. Oh no, I'm, 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 I lost. Ha! Huh. Cool. Game is da -da 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 done.
I mean, maybe we can find something. I mean, evocation's not bad. He's not gonna be overloaded next turn though, which is the worst part. I mean, I can trade this away. Derek, thank you so much for the $10. I will more officially thank you in like one second. I need to, oh crap. And I'll ignite his face, I guess. I don't know. And I'll kill off his frozen minion, actually. And then I keep these cards. But I'm an idiot. I don't want to keep these cards, because now I'm going to overdraw Cthune. Oh my god. No, thank goodness they go away. Okay, he has eight mana. He can't combo. He's used both lightning blooms. Wait, he used both lightning blooms. So his combo's ruined. Wait, I can still win. I just need to draw Cthune. And I use my second shadow step, so I can't use Cthune a second time. Wait, did the shatter not go off? I swear I played Shatter! Did I not? Oh, that was Flurry. Oh, okay. That makes me happier that it, I didn't... Okay, I just misread it. That's fine. I do that all the time. But thanks so much, Derek, for the $20. Are you partnering tomorrow night or are you going to do a New Year's Eve stream? I'm going to do a stream probably. Um, at least for a little bit. Probably not at nighttime. I'll probably do it in midday. And then I'm going to go to bed early and go to Disneyland on actual New Year's Day. He eats Korak, please, not want. Oh my god, he hate want beef. Well, I lost. I- oh my god. <laughs> we drew Tenwu, but that doesn't matter anymore. I mean, Cthune doesn't win me the game. But he keeps me alive for a turn, maybe? I mean, we're off by a little bit of damage, right? Oh my gosh, wait, that's lethal! Wait, because that's 32, he's at 2! Oh my god! That's disgusting! Oh my god, there's no shot! I must have misplayed so many times! So, I think it's gonna be coin out sketchy information, right? Do I want to keep Swindle? I feel like draw is pretty good in this deck. I'll get rid of it. I feel like Swindle is one of those cards where it looks like it would be good to keep in your mulligan, but if you actually look at like the mulligan win rates and stuff, it actually kind of underperforms. Considering like how much it's it's usually kept. I don't know, maybe it's just the type of decks that I am looking at the stats for this for, but I don't know. So not Maestra, Thief Rogue. Weird. Definitely weird. Do I want to coin out Ticketmaster or sketchy information first? I think Ticketmaster to get something out on the board might be better. I think it's probably better to go Ticketmaster here. Because there are a couple of directions I can go with that. It's just pressure. And then we can go sketchy information. Maybe we get Lillian. Great. Or Korak. And we get a minion on the board. Or more tickets with Ticketmaster. And then you can play that with like a Cutlass next turn or trade or something. I don't know. But I think just pressure on the board now is better. Trust no one. Not Trust no one. Not but I think it's interesting that you guys think Talon is worse than Mancrit. Because Talon specifically draws me Malagos or Jandis if I've already drawn Malagos at this point. Okay. I'm fine with that. We can play Lillian next turn. We just need to control the board as much as possible and get to Scabs. I feel like Scabs is the most important. I guess Mancrick is kind of nice over Talon because it does give me a like an extra Shadow Step target theoretically. That's a weird card to have in the deck. No, wait, he got that off of Swashburglar. I'm crazy. Four or five goes down to zero no matter what if you have Maestra because you're the other class. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Hopefully he doesn't draw a one cost card immediately. Oh, he could be going cute rogue. That's one damage and that's a 6-6. Six, six. I might have to mauve Cthune it. Which isn't terrible. I actually don't mind it. I'm fine mauve Cthuning that. We drew Malagos. And I mean, with Seeger Passage and the extra draw, do I even really need to do anything crazy? 
hit the 1-1. One, one. Actually, no. I guess going face there is fine. It's just a 1-1 one, one at this point. He's not going to shadow step it. Um, but yeah, maybe Talon's worse than Mancrick. Talon is good only... Your only reliable taunt to stall. I mean, that's another thing, right? Like, I can copy Talon with the Lieutenant sometimes, which can be really, really nice. Like, it can actually, like... It can, it can win me games sometimes. Because I get to stall out a ton of extra. Uh, okay, let's see what we get here. Jandis, interesting... We have to go with this. Like, there's nothing else you can really play. SI Extortion. I mean, we can we can kill off the 2-1, I guess. Just keep some pressure on the board. We can play Jandis next turn, Shadow Step it. Or wait until turn, like, 9 or 10 and do, like, a crazy play and just play Talon. Whoa. You're crazy, dude. You're crazy for that one. He probably is my Estra, just bugged and turned into a rogue. You, that can happen. I had no idea that could happen. Like I said, to kill a minion. Okay. Seeker Passage. We don't want to do that until next turn to look for scabs or something. So I'm going to go boom in hero power and just go doink and doink. I took a little bit more damage that way, which I'm not super happy about, but being at 19 with him being one wicked stab down is nice. I was wondering maybe I should switch decks, but I really enjoy this deck and I really want to see it work. I really do, and I think it can. In time. Korak is not bad. Don't eat Melly. He eats Korak. I mean, I don't really care about that, do I? But I don't want to bounce anything back to hand either. Oh, shoot. There are multiple cards I could get here that would be good. Scabs, admittably, is kind of one of them. But then he eats an important guy like Malagos, and then what do I do? Then I just lose. I don't have another death rattle card for this, so this is useless. This is useless. I mean, I, I guess I do just scabs. And maybe he eats the 3-3. Three, three. But if he scabs second, I just lose. God, I hate this. Oh my god. I don't want to use that, we're just going to pass. I mean, if he eats Ten Wu, that sucks. If he eats Mally, I mean, at this point, I actually think it would be better if he ate Mally. I just don't want Ten Wu, because Ten Wu is a combo card. I mean, Jandis would suck. I don't know, this is bad. I just didn't really have that many playable things. What, I had Jandis? Which, I mean, isn't terrible. Are you not going to play Mutanus? Interest. Holy shit. Oh. Oh, God. And I just used scabs. Oh, shit. I mean, this doesn't even do anything at this point. I mean, it kills a 10 10, which is great, I guess. I look for Heart of Cthulhu off of you, maybe? I mean, this does kill it. I can kill this off and potentially not die this turn. Jeez Louise, I'm actually so doomed. Wait, are you zero? Can I just kill it? I think I can just kill it, and then I get to SI Extortion this, and then I think at this point, honestly, it's trade time. Oh, I hated that. I hated trading, but I had to or I was going to die. I'm just going to take so much damage. I guess I didn't need to trade the last two. I more panicked, but I mean, if I go late game, I think I'm more favored than he is. Holy crap. Thank goodness I drew no tickets, and I only drew one Cthune piece. Like, that actually saved me. 
I have no more death rattle minions, so my forsaken lieutenants are pretty useless at this point. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. That's useless. That's... Okay, you didn't hero power first. Oh, God. Oh, yikeroo. Oh, yikeroo. I think it's gonna be double Jandis this turn. Hope for a taunt, kill the 1-1. One, one. Oh, man. I missed three damage. I don't think that really matters. What makes something real? Um, you're good. I like you a lot, actually. We're gonna play another one. I mean, a spell damage or Ross would be amazing. Wait, 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 wait. Yes. Okay. I have a plan. I have a plan, and it's simple. All I've got to do is play a buttload of spells, right? That's all I got to do. I need to play you, and then I need to play this bounce again. I don't even need to necessarily play her. I don't even need to necessarily play her. I just need to stack this up. That becomes zero. We go Cloak and we go Jandis. And if we get more spell damage, I mean, that's kind of cracked, actually. And then we rush. That should wipe, right? No, I was off in the math. That was okay. Honestly, could have been worse. Oh, no, I'm going to overdraw a Cthune piece. No. If I overdraw a Cthune piece, I'm going to lose it. Don't, don't do it. They're... Trust no one. Not trust no one. Not even me. Don't do it. Don't do it to me. Okay, I overdrew a ticket. That's fine. Okay, what's the plan? I have no idea. Boom, Ross, secret passage, and then hope for a brain freeze. Oh my god! Okay, we're so good at this game, it's not even funny. We are simply better than our opponents. So you should have three damage now. We go face. Ross will kill those, right? You do three. Oh, thank you so much. Oh my god. Seeing you rage is hilarious. Look, man, when you play as much Hearthstone as I do, it, wait, <gasps> and Vectus with the death rattles. Oh my goodness gracious. Swap the highest attack and the lowest attack minions. I'll play this, he'll be a one- Oh my god. I don't care. This is crazy, though. What a crazy, crazy game. Kills the 3-4. What, you're killing Mazaki? I guess that makes sense. I might have killed Ross if I were you, but fair enough. Oh, what if it's counter? Wait, he's a rogue, so it can't be counter. That scabs is a pro gamer move. Wow! Wow, 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 wow! We won! Holy moly! That was crazy!